Today we're going to be talking about some research that our team recently completed on green tea and its immunomodulatory effects. Background on green tea. Some people consider it nature's antibiotic. It was discovered around 4,000 years ago in China. It's most consumed beverage after water. In fact, I'm having a cup of it right here. It's produced from the fresh leaves of Camellia sinensis. That's the Latin name. What is the composition of green tea? Well, 4% dry is caffeine, 6 to 8% is minerals, 8 to 12% is amino acids, but 30 36% of it is polyphenols, and it contains really nine important minerals, 13 different amino acids. The other thing is, these are the catechins in green tea, epicatechin, epicatechin gallate, ECG, epogallocatechin, EGC, and one of the most powerful ones is epogallocatechin gallate, EGCG. So in the adaptive immune system, EGCG goes, it suppresses NF-kappa beta and AP1, which then are not able to produce TNF-alpha, IL-6, MC P1 and IL-1 beta, which are the things that create the cytokine storm. The other very interesting thing that EGCG also does is that it effectively inhibits IMDPH, so it leads to suppression of pro-inflammatory T cells and thereby reduction of inflammation. EGCG actually destroys viruses, destroys bacteria, destroys the fungi, and it inhibits the binding of that virus to the cell surface, and it also stops the replication process. EGCG also has an antibacterial effect, as you call causes membrane disruption. It also destroys the DNA of the bacteria. Very powerful. And it's also antifungal. It disrupts the membrane. It destroys the DNA of the fungi. And it also inhibits ergosterol synthesis, which is necessary for building the fungal cell walls on the innate immune system. Look what L-theanine does, the amino acid in green tea. L-theanine promotes the proliferation of gamma delta T cells. Now, gamma delta T cells directly kill microbes. There's a Another important amino acid, theophylline, in green tea, which it acts as something for people with asthma as a bronchodilator, relaxes the smooth muscles, reduce severity and asthma symptoms.